Hey everyone, Adam here. I am back with another reaction and this time I'm reacting to a song that I've actually reacted to before, but this is the live version and the choir version. So this is Scott Hoying and the song Mars. Now, obviously I did a reaction to the official music video, but I'm excited. People were telling me, somebody in particular, told me to check this out because apparently this version is incredible. So I'm so excited to check this out. Here we go. This is Scott Hoying and Mars live, the choir version. Let's do this. What did I say? The room had turned cold. Their eyes died away. No text on my phone. Nice. Baby, like me, it's been broken. Very mm. Scott note there. What did I do? Too quiet, too bold. Mm. Did I seem confused? Every day, so alone. Nice cry there. I become frozen. Nice. And you said, I don't think they're human. It's live vocals. Perfect. It must be from Mars. Which explains how amazing you are. Mm. Nice slide there. The sun and the stars, and we'll fall in love on Mars. Mm. Whoa. Wow. Beautiful. Hey. Everything's hard But when I mm. 
seconds from take off You hold out your arms And bring me back home to Beautiful, beautiful. Let's leave that there. Oh my God, that is the best version of that song I have ever heard. Beautiful. I think what I loved about this performance the most was just the passion in Scott's voice. Like every single lyric that he sang, he just meant. It was beautiful, like dripping in passion. It was just wonderful. Like the vocal athletics that he was doing in this entire performance were just amazing. I mean, there was things here that Scott was doing I've never heard him do before. Like some of the runs he was doing were like phenomenal. There was some real interesting like Scott cries that are like very signature to him that were lovely to hear. And as well, just that higher register really pushing up into that and those slides when he was going up there. And that one particular note when he kind of really just rallied right the way up to the high point and kept it there as well. That beautiful head voice just coming out of him. That was wonderful. I mean, wow. You know, don't ever be sleeping on Scott because Scott has a beautiful voice and understands it inside out, knows how to get the best out of his voice. And just the technical capabilities of his voice is just wonderful. Knows when to belt, knows when to bring those quieter moments, knows how to do them incredibly well, uses vibrato so brilliantly in a way that I absolutely love right at the end of the notes, which is just wonderful knows how to storytell in a song as well. I mean, this is the whole package right here. And then to top all of that off, my favorite thing is choirs when they're used in music like this. When a choir comes in, supports people, it's wonderful. Like stunning. I know that this is labeled the choir version, so I knew it was coming, but I love like just the starts, like singing a cappella, which is so brave, especially when he comes from a vocal harmony group as well. And it's just him out there doing that live as well. So incredible. And then to bring the piano in and then to gradually introduce the choir, you know, it's just wonderfully done. And it adds a nice sense of build to the song as well, where we start off with this, just him, just him and the piano. Then the choir comes in, builds that really epic middle portion as well, where they're all vocalizing. They're all singing the lyrics back to him, which must be wonderful as a songwriter to hear this choir singing the lyrics that you wrote back to you as well and supporting you and you singing the song is amazing. And then to come back to a quiet moment as well at the end, it perfectly bookmarks the whole performance. A cappella at the beginning, a cappella at the end, a little bit of a tingle on the piano as well. Just wonderful. Like the construction of this live performance was epic. Truly, truly epic. And again, you know, the camera going all the way around him in one take to do this in one take, that is impressive. And I know like obviously live performances, of course, that one take, but just you know, the camera never went off him once. It was always on him, completely just governed the space. You know, he's such a showman where standing up from that piano, knowing when to take that microphone, knowing when to really lean into the camera, just being there, just speaking to everybody. It was just magnificent. I mean, absolute showmanship, just really, really wonderful. Wow, 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 wow. This is the version of the song that I will show people. This is how you do it. This is how you do a live performance with a choir as well. Just genius magnificent, such a spectacle to watch as well as to listen to. The build in this song, oh, one of the best I've ever heard, honestly, with a choir support and you like that, this is the way you do it. But what did you think of Scott Hoyne and his performance of Mars with the choir behind him and live? You know what to do by now. Please leave me comments down below with your thoughts. And if you have any other suggestions by Scott, please leave those down below as well. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Please come and subscribe to the channel if you don't already and make sure you hit that bell icon as well. It's the fastest way to get new notifications of when a brand new video like this drops. If you do want to jump in and help support the channel on Patreon, the link and details for that are just down below. We do have a few little exclusive goodies on there. For example, I do a monthly check-in every single month with my Patreon subscribers, as well as a few little exclusive goodies you can only see in there. So if you do want to jump in and help support the channel, that would be incredible. Thank you so much. The link and details for that are just down below. So well, thank you again everybody i hope you enjoyed this just like i did this was incredible thank you to the special someone that suggested this this was amazing the best version of the song and i can't wait to listen to it again until next time take care